So, uh, just, so just to give you an example of how it's going to look before we actually do the actual exercise, you're going to put your hands at shoulders width, okay? I want you to look down the line of your body because I want you to make sure that your body is aligned properly, right? That's that proper form and technique I was referring to. Before you even get started, I want you to contract your, that's right, your abs, and I want you to contract your, that's right, your glutes. Or if you had those in reverse, you still got it right, okay? And when you go down, I want you to count three going down. I want you to pause for one and come up in one, okay? That's going to be the general motion. Now, though women can do the exact same exercise, there's an alternative way to do it as well. Um, if you want to, you can, again, put your hands at shoulders width, but you're going to be on your knees, and the soles of your feet are going to be facing the ceiling, but the same motion, right? One, two, three, pause, up. One, two, three, pause, up, okay? Works just as well, all right? So we're going to start off by doing eight reps. If eight reps is too much for you, start off with three. Start off with four. Don't despise small beginnings, okay? Start off at a level where you're going to be able to use your proper form and technique. But always remember, you're a lot stronger than you think, all right? So let's go. We're going to do eight here. And I'm going to look down the line of my body, contracting my abs, contracting my glutes. And let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Excellent. Right? We're going to take our 30 second active rest here again by keeping those abs contracted and your glutes contracted, this becomes, uh, there's like a core exercise embedded in something that you have probably thought of as just an up, upper body exercise for years, okay? Let's take that active rest again. You can dance, you can do whatever you like during this active rest period, okay? And remember, stay focused, don't give up. You know, the road to success is paved with dedication. So dedicate yourself to the process, dedicate yourself to you, all right? So we're done with that 30 second active rest period. Now we're gonna switch up the exercise where we're gonna do a one and a half body weight squat, okay? So what you're gonna do is you're gonna get into, I'm gonna do this from the side so you can appreciate what's really going on here, right? You're gonna contract your abs, right? Your legs are gonna be at shoulders width and when you start, you're gonna start with your knees slightly bent, this way, your quads and your hands are getting an exercise at all time, all right? Put the hands on the side of your head, and you're going to go down in one, right, where your legs are parallel to the floor. Come up halfway. Go back down. That's one. Come up halfway. Go back down. That's two. Yeah. Come up halfway. Go back down. That's three. Come up halfway. Go back down. That's four. Remember, when you feel that burn, the burn is your bliss, all right? <laughs> Go back down. Come back up halfway. That's five. Go back down. Come back up. Go back down halfway. That's six. Go back down. Come up halfway. Go back down. Seven. Go down. Come up halfway. Go back down. Eight. And always start and begin with those knees slightly bent. Again, when you feel that burn, <laughs> the burn is not a bad thing. The burn is a good thing, okay? And the burn is your bliss. Again, that's going to help you to burn calories. It's going to really strengthen your legs, whether you're, you know, looking to run or whether you're just looking to stay in shape or you just want to look good, <laughs> all right? That's going to really help, all right? We got about 15 seconds here. Left, we're taking that active rest period right here. Remember, just persevere, focus, be patient with yourself. You know, Joshua Wapersky once said, there's no place that patience and perseverance cannot take you. And that is so true. Just be patient with yourself and persevere to the end, all right?